All right, I wanted to make a video, help other people out uh, with what I've learned on installing a sequential LED tail light from uh, Bright Lights, uh, or let's see, Bright Two Wheels. Um, it's a nice unit. Let's see, I've got a rope hooked up to my brake light. I like how it works. Um, so that's the brake light function. And then it'll just stay on solid. Um, the turn signal, which I can turn on now, looks like that. Um, but you have to install a relay, and uh, when you do that, it uh, causes the front lights, which are still just the stock incandescent bulb um, causes them to just work like that uh, stay on and obviously we want them to blink um, the instructions that came with it were for a completely different bike or for like a six or 750 or 600 um, and it shows Hooking up the uh, relay, but it's on a different bike, different relay, and um, so anyways, I, uh, I actually smoked the first one, so I had to get another LED relay flasher. They're like a dollar on uh, eBay, so not bad, but basically you gotta back this wire out and um, you leave this one plugged in, but you just tap in. I'm, I'm not done wiring it up. Um, it'll look better than this when I'm done, but this is just for initial setup. Um, anyways, my fix for uh, the issue of um, basically getting rid of hyper flash or getting rid of the thing just staying on all the time is uh, I was upgrading to these uh, cheap Chinese um, LEDs, but they're also sequential, which I like. I like the design on them. They're like 16, 17 bucks. Um, but unfortunately, the first one that I uh, wired up only worked for like 20 minutes. Um, so I'm kind of pissed about that. Because I, I modified the wiring a little bit. I soldered on my own bullet connectors and uh, heat shrink tube. And um, like I know my solder connections are good and tight. And um, when you hook this one up to power now, it just gives this very brief um, flicker and then goes out. And uh, anyways. So there's like a, um, a circuit board behind those LEDs and uh, either the connection at the circuit board um, came apart or there's like a resistor or something in there that has already died. So yay, cheap Chinese one. So now I'm, I've got this one plugged into power just to test its uh, longevity. We'll see if it works longer than 20 minutes. Um, didn't even finish getting it all hooked up onto the bike and it died. So I'll probably be uh, either asking for a replacement one and crossing my fingers that it lasts longer. Maybe I just got one dud, right? Maybe. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, so the bright. Bright two wheels, uh, one seems to be working fine, um, but if you get that, you're either going to have hyper flash, uh, or you're going to have your front turn signals just stuck on uh, until you upgrade the front turn signals too, and hopefully you get some better quality ones than what I'm working with right now, so good luck out there guys.